Hello Marauders, Rain here. It is Saturday, um, February 18th, 2023. It is something like 3.30 p.m. I'm at Station F, as you can see. You can see still here Binance and Meta and uh, a bunch of other, you know, incubators here and there. Um, so why am I doing uh, a vlog on uh, on Saturday? Uh, it is because I just want to have, uh, I just want to create a new format, you know, a recap of everything that we have been working on uh, the week, um, trying to be as short as possible. So for you guys to know, um, this week uh, we uh, have been, uh, on Seneca, we have been working, of course, still on the marketplace. We are adding the... Um, the um the feed feature where you guys are going to be able to um see every news every activity from a collection or a user that you follow and also um you know uh metrics uh, about all of these you know collections and also users um regarding uh their activity on on the blockchain so that's what we are adding right now. It is really, really interesting. We are also aggregating uh, news from other platforms, um, such as one of my favorite, uh, Lucky Trader. Um, these guys are super great. I mean, they have the the, the best news um, instantly. I really do love um, their 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 work. Uh, so that's what we are working on right now on 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 the marketplace. But also, as you might know from now, uh, for quite some weeks now, um, even though from, you know, last last November to, to December, um, I've had a lot of um, talkings with Ellen uh, and Ludovic about, you know, um, creating a, uh, a new feature, a creator studio to make sure that everyone could, um, you know, create their NFTs, create their collection, even though we, that's, that's, that's just, something on the side but i really do think that uh, in the future people are not going to say nfts they are more like you know going to say digital assets or collectibles depending on the vertical where they are uh working or where they are gathering these these assets uh whatever so we are working on that we are working on a creator studio so come you can compare it to Manifold, you can compare it to Foundation, you can compare it to Zara. Um, that's what we are, you know, uh, truly working on right now. That's 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 really, really interesting. And also, uh, we do think that it is going to be the next wave towards the next mass adoption of NFTs. Uh, it, should, it should come from these type of NFTs, you know, created by people that are more likely to um, to gather other people with them. What am I saying here is that we are all seeing that NFTs and crypto as a whole has a huge, huge, huge trust issue. But um, think of it, if, you know, one of your favorite uh, influencer on Instagram, you know, the one who makes you laugh every week because you are following his um, YouTube videos, uh, you feel like, you know, it's been a, it's been a lot of years since the the first time you 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 were following this guy and uh and you know you 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 can you are connecting uh, with with the guy and uh, you feel trust in him and uh, then he creates nfts and he tells you that you know it is not for uh, speculation it is just a way for him to measure um you know um uh how many fans are really engaging with him and then he will be able to uh reward them uh because they have been um you know um watching to their the sound i made was really weird by the way <laughs> uh, the the, the 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 way they were engaging with the, the 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 celebrity or the influencer um then he will reward them um uh, accordingly um that's that's just a simple use case but we do think that this is the way um uh mass adoption will come um and other ways i think that are going to be really difficult as of now we we, we think that the people that should have, you know, should have been into the NFT world and the crypto world are here already because everyone knows about uh, crypto. Everyone knows about NFTs, but still a, a very, very few people are uh, really into that world. So this is just a trust issue. And, and of course, besides the trust issue, there's the utility issue where people are wondering, okay, if, even though I'm, I'm trusting that thing, why should I come here? Why would I be uh, involved in this? Why would I uh, pay or even just claim a free NFT from 
someone that I do not know and for some utility that I don't really understand or that, that I really don't see. Um, that's the reason why. Trust, utility. And these NFTs from the creators, from you know our creator studio and others also uh, could bring that um, because you know as I was saying for, with the example of an influencer or anything else, it could bring that. But also on the other hand, uh, there is also the brands. Uh, as you probably you already know about that if you follow the vlogs, we are of course uh, and and Sandaga as a whole, we are of course uh, we have been talking with a lot of brands since, um, since you know, uh, we, we started that, that whole uh, journey. Um, they are all super interested. Once again, they, they, they feel like NFTs uh, are something that it is going to change uh, how people consume products, how people consume uh, digital products and physical products. But they also feel like they, they have been um, trust issues on that and they don't feel the utility too. So they were like, okay, uh, first of all, if we do NFTs, people are going to be like, oh, they do NFTs. They are bad. This is a bad word. We, 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 we don't like them anymore. First thing. And second thing, if they don't feel that way, they will be like, okay, but what is it for? What is the purpose of it? Why, why, why should I collect an NFT from that brand? What, what is it going to be to bring me in terms of value? Um, and that's also what we are uh, reaching for. We are going to be helping brands towards that way, as we wanted to do um, through the Dago Labs. But now, with what we are renaming as the Senega Studio, um, we will give them the tool to do so. Where in in in, in the Dago Labs, we just wanted to you know create them, uh, create these NFTs with them, and the um, in the the Senega studio we want them to have the tools to create their nfts but also us helping them creating uh the uh the 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 best way for them to to do what they want so it is going to be things that is that are not going to be able to do with the creator studio so this is going to be a tailored um uh way uh, of doing so so that's that's a, a very hard thing that we are adding to uh, to Sandaga as a whole, and of course the marketplace size size sorry is going to 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 play a huge role in this because it is going to be where the secondary market is going to is going to to, to happen for these brands and these creators all around the world, uh, and also they are going to be able to have their own marketplaces. Of course, they are all going to be linked directly to Sandaga, but of course they are going to be having there is their marketplace in Sandaga if they want to, but also they're going to be able to 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 embed that 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 in that marketplace sorry on their own website with with a, a little piece of code um and of course today where you see where uh open is going to with blur and all of the other marketplaces towards royalties um there is only one way to to not only one way i hate to say this because of course there might be other ways but in my opinion the best way is um, for creators of these NFTs or these assets to have their own marketplace, even though it is linked to a, a, a bigger one that is respecting their royalties, but they still have their own marketplace on their own website with their with their own royalty policy. Um, and this is enforced on the blockchain and you cannot do anything else but to respect them. Um, so that's pretty much it. That's why, that's how we, we, we feel about this. And we do feel also that the layer, I'm sorry, the video is super long, but you know, that's the, 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 the recap of that whole idea. I want you guys to understand. And you know, that, that layer of, um, of social that we are adding onto the uh, marketplace, but it was scheduled way before, um, uh, way before now, but this is also going to make them able to uh, be more uh, involved with their community. I'm talking about creators, but also for uh, users and holders from these collections, they are going to be able to see um, in their feed when an influencer or a brand is adding, for example, is adding a new uh, benefit to their NFTs. Uh, and also, of course, their, uh, their um, um, you know, news and what they are doing uh, and stuff like this. So that's that's really important for us to have that type of vision more than the vision where we want to compete with Blur, we want to compete with OpenSea towards uh, making sure that anyone wa who, 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 who wants to buy a Bored Ape or uh, a Mutant Ape or a Cool Cats or an Azuki, 
uh, are going are going to come to 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 Sendaga. Um, we are changing a little a little bit our vision, our focus towards these type of NFTs. But of course, NFTs like Beg, Make, Azuki, Cool Cats, Marauders, of course, they are going to be able to be traded on Sendaga. Of course, but um, we 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 are really looking uh, forward to these type of you know new NFTs from new creators, new brands, trusted creators, trusted brands uh, with, uh, you know, utility that is going to be uh, more concrete for, you know, normal users, because for us, we do not even feel it. But, you know, when Blur or any other marketplaces, and I do respect Blur a lot, are saying, yes, if you do buy uh, things here, you are going to have an airdrop of tokens don't say that to my mom or yours or or anyone who is not into crypto. What the hell am I going to do with with tokens and airdrop? What is an airdrop? What tokens? What is this? How do I claim my tokens? How do I I I, I transfer them? I I convert them to dollars. How how does how does that whole whole world works? Uh, that's that's way too 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 far from uh, what the mass uh, uh, market should be. Um, uh, on, you know, so that's what we are working towards too. And, uh, that's the reason why we was super excited. So that was for Sundag. I'm sorry <laughs> that the video is super long. Uh, I, I'll, I'll make a better one next time, but I wanted to make sure once again, that that vision is clear for you guys. And for the Marauders, uh, as you know, we have been having, uh, um, a meeting with, um, with Sebastian Abdelhamid, uh, once again, super nice guy. I mean, this guy is, is, is incredibly um, good at what he's doing and he's a really, really incredible human being and um, I love that guy so much. So uh, we have been working on that. So on the Marauders, you guys already know what we are kind of doing uh, if you if you follow everything and you <laughs> you make the puzzle. Uh, that's, that's, that's really, really a huge thing that we are trying to do for the Marauders. Uh, Sebastian is helping us a lot. Omar is helping us too. Uh, we are going to have a meeting with Omar in uh, April, May. Uh, that is going to be very, very important. And then after that, we are going to go through a new phase where we are going to be uh, trying to involve more people into the, 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 the whole thing. But at that time, you should have a little bit more news, even though it is going to be still, uh, you know, very hmm, hard for us to say anything. Whatever, just know that we are working hard on it. And Ludovic is getting a uh, bigger and bigger and bigger uh, role on the, 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 the Marauders than he has on Sandaga because it, it is um, the Marauders are taking, are taking more and more and more time, which is totally normal. Um, so that's, that's pretty much how the team is getting to, you know, being split up. Um, that's it. So that's pretty much it, guys. I mean, I know that you guys are also wondering about the the the, the fundraise and our runway. So our runway have been, you know, a little bit optimized since the last time I talked about it. So we are around twelve months of runway. Runway means that it is um, um, the time that we can continue like this with our expenses um, and um, regarding our. Um, Treasury? Do we do we say this in, in in English? Treasury? Yeah. I mean, the money that we do have right now in our bank account and the money that we do perceive uh, every month. So um, that's it. And of course, for the fundraise, we should have been beginning at the end of January uh, to get back to VCs and get back on another, um, you know, um, um, uh, you know, road um, uh, towards them. But uh, all of these new things need to be understood from the team and we need to make sure that everything is um, working towards that. That's the reason why I decided to uh, make the most of my time to make sure that this is going to happen the way uh, I see it. Uh, but it is almost done and I'm super proud of the team. They are super excited too about the product and then I'll be able to get back to, uh, um, to the VCs and I'm super, super uh, confident about that. We do have super contact. Um, the new vision is going to be also, I mean, it's not a super new vision. Of course, we do have that for um, the past months, but uh, the VC doesn't know about that. And um, it is it is going to be something very, very interesting. Uh, that's pretty much it. 15 minutes. I'm sorry about the <laughs> the length of it, but I needed to to make sure that you guys would understand everything because I know that following every, you know, every vlogs is not really easy. So here is the recap. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for following us and supporting us um, from the beginning. Uh, we are working hard, trust me. 
and uh, we are going where we want to. You can trust me on that too. So thank, thank you, thank you. Once again, we're super thankful and we are going to make everything we can uh, to go where we want to. Thank you guys, thank you Marauders. Have a wonderful uh, weekend with your loved ones and, uh, and see you guys next week. See you Marauders.